Hey everyone, this is ReefGuy92 and I'm going to show you guys how to do ChemiClean. I'm coming at you from my 175. I've done a ChemiClean treatment. That cyanobacteria has gone nowhere. This sand bed is gross. Look at it. Give you a little close up. I've got red cyano. I've got green cyano. I got cyano for everyone. The Narcera snails have done their job in keeping the tank clean, but they don't eat cyanobacteria. I have dosed the ChemiClean treatment. I have put in only half, um, about 12 level scoops for my 175 gallon with a 30 gallon sump. So I'm technically running just a little over 200 gallons. Uh, I like to do a half dose just because it keeps things, uh, I like to be on the safe side. If I need to repeat, I can always repeat. My skimmer is still on because I really want to oxygenate the water. It does better than any air stone you can ever buy. Um, you can see that it's just overflowing and going crazy right now and that's because of the ChemiClean treatment. Um, day one, cyano still here. We'll check back. We're going to put back in this exact same spot and we will see how the ChemiClean treatment makes out in tomorrow. Give you guys to look at so I still got some cyano but I do see improvement here and very happy to see improvement because this stuff is disgusting skimmer is still going crazy and wild that's to be expected and it's good that it's adding lots of oxygenation for the tank um, it's probably one of the better things they always say to turn it off but I've always kept them on um, just because that gives the oxygenation that the tank needs and guess what it is looking a hundred times better. This is the part we've zoomed in on. Had a lot of green, red cyano in the last couple pictures. And it looks like we've just got diatomes really left at this point, which is great. So happy to see that. It makes my sand bed look a thousand times better. It's on its way to getting cleared up. And I expected diatomes when I put this tank together just because it was sand that I had used previously and rinsed um, from a last tank and last project. So kind of comes with what I had used and uh, but I'm really happy I'm super happy with ChemiClean it has worked nothing in my tank has shriveled up nothing in my tank has died and everything looks good coral safe only thing today that has been bothered this little head of the torch and I'm pretty sure the only reason why it's being bothered is because this clownfish is trying to host or it's trying to host the clownfish and it's not happy about the idea Cyano is gone. This is the morning of. I just took a video last night and we are looking a whole lot better. I have now picked up a white sleeper goby and I'm hoping that he's going to kind of clean up the rest of the sand bag, keep everything nice and clean because there's some spots still that are kind of gross but we're not looking at cyano. I think it's more diatomes and a bit of algae so hopefully he'll work. Tank looks good. Cyano or ChemiClean treated and perfectly no harm to any corals. This is a full reef tank. And uh, this is three days later and nothing has been harmed. Nothing even looks sad at all. Everything looks really healthy and happy. And uh, no corals are lost or fish were lost. So completely reef safe. So now I'm going to perform the 20 gallon water change. They say to do 20%. Um, I'm doing a little less, I'm lazy. And I've got the water ready to go. This has all been pre-mixed, ready to go, heated. And I'm going to swap out 20 gallons of water really quick. I've added carbon back into the filter sock to hopefully weed out the ChemiClean treatment and get this tank back to normal. Hey guys, I'd like to thank you very much for watching this uh, little exclusive on ChemiClean. Uh, again, perfectly reef safe, never had an issue with this stuff. It's been a great lifesaver. And uh, if you guys ever hesitate to use it in your reef tank, don't. Uh, it's one of those chemical treatments that I found no issues with. It is perfectly reef safe, just like it says, and uh, I've never had any issues. Just use a little less if you're a little worried about your tank's uh, inhabitants, and I think you'll have just positive results. Thanks again for watching. Click subscribe, and uh, look forward to getting uh, more videos on weekly. So check back every Saturday morning at 7 a.m. Thanks again, guys. Have yourself a great day.